Examining the Nautilus, we can see how evolution transformed a mere bottom feeder into a buoyant battleship. At its head, a mass of 90 or more muscular tentacles can extend from sheaths to seize its prey. Nautiloids found a way to swim by jet propulsion. Water is taken in and rapidly forced out of a funnel that steers and propels the Nautilus. It evolved from the ancient foot to become like a flexible exhaust pipe that also serves as a rudder. A thin sheet of muscle, the mantle, surrounds the internal organs, while at the same time secreting the hard calcium layers of its famous chambered shell. An ancient nautilus was the original jaws, the first animal with vertically clamping mouthparts. Within this jaw is its radula, with teeth that can shred a lobster's discarded shell. Every feature of the Nautilus design is a legacy from its ancestors and the world they encountered. In order to stay buoyant as it grows, the Nautilus must remove this seawater from its shell. To do so, it uses a tube called the siphuncle, which spirals through every chamber. Cells in this tube gradually pull the water into the animal's blood system, leaving only gas. The secret to maintaining buoyancy.